Not long ago, Panasonic introduced the Lumix S5 II, which was a notable addition to the Lumix camera series. However, since then, there has been little information about the release of a cinema camera from Panasonic. Meanwhile, Canon has launched three new cameras, and Nikon and Sony have also introduced a few. So you might be wondering, where is the Lumix S1H2? Well, we've got some good news for you. We've recently got our hands on a patent related to a heat dissipation mechanism. This patent, titled Imaging Device, showcases an innovation for enhancing heat dissipation quality while minimizing any adverse effects on sound quality. In practical terms, this technology will improve heat dissipation in large sensor cameras, enabling them to capture ultra-high resolution images. That means Panasonic is planning to bring other major upgrades rather than only integrating a phase detection autofocus system. And the last two patents are proof of that. These two patents focus on improving the capabilities of compact cinema cameras. The first patent was about a variable built-in electronic ND filter. But why the heat dissipation in a compact body, you may wonder? Well, we think Panasonic is aiming for shooting high resolution, probably 8K or beyond. Professional filmmakers usually don't use compact cinema cameras, so Lumix trying to gather engagement from that specific niche is fascinating. Did you know that 72% of visitors are more likely to make their purchases soon after watching a product video? This makes it necessary to have a product demonstration or promo video for showcasing your product's potential values and benefits. At Product Video Studio, we are equipped with camera gear, tools, and most importantly, expertise to make your video captivating and engaging. Just send your products and we'll handle the rest. Contact us today to create something amazing together. Now, let's discuss the theoretical part. Bear with us as this can become a bit complex. This is a device for taking pictures and videos. It has a main body, and at the top of the main body, there's a place for a cooling fan. The trend these days is for better image quality and performance, especially when recording videos. But as we try to get better images, the device tends to get hotter, mainly because of the camera sensor and engine. If it gets too hot, the device might stop working, which is a problem. Usually, to cool it down, we need things like fans and heat sinks, but they make the device bigger and less attractive. However, with this device, it cools down effectively without making a lot of noise, so it stays small and looks good while keeping the heat under control. Even when components like the image sensor and engine produce a lot of heat, this imaging device efficiently cools them down with a system that includes a cooling fan and a heat sink. This ensures the device doesn't overheat and stop working. The cooling system is cleverly placed at the upper center of the device, in front of the EVF unit so it doesn't make the device bulky and still keeps it cool while looking good. Panasonic's recent patents aim to address two common issues in cinema cameras, heat buildup and ND filtration. By tackling these challenges, they plan to enhance their Lumix brand. Panasonic intends to release more mid and compact cinema cameras with these improvements, and the Lumix S1H2 and BS1H2 are next in line, as we already know these cameras are due for a long time. Rumors suggest that Panasonic is preparing to release its first 8K-enabled cinema camera. This new camera, called the S1H Mark II, is a successor to Panasonic's flagship video-focused camera, the Panasonic Lumix S1H, which was introduced in 2019. The S1H Mark II will feature a substantial 50-megapixel full-frame sensor, allowing it to capture extremely fine details with remarkable clarity. It will also come equipped with a new phase detect autofocus system borrowed from the Panasonic Lumix S5 II, ensuring that your subjects stay sharp and in focus even when they're moving quickly. But the capabilities of the S1H Mark II don't end there. It will be capable of recording 8K video at up to 60 frames per second in the DCI format. Additionally, it will offer the flexibility to shoot 4K video at 120 frames per second for smoother motion. Just like its predecessor, the original S1H, which is approved by Netflix for professional use, we can expect the S1H Mark II to maintain this standard of quality and approval for filmmakers. So what do you think about these latest patents? 
Do you own a Lumix cinema camera? Share your thoughts in the comments section below. Consider subscribing for more content like this, and as always, thanks for watching.